Recent military operations by the Nigerian military, led by the Chief of Army Staff, Lieutenant General Tuko Buraitai, and the Chief of Air Staff, Air Marshal Sadiq Abubakar, should be commended by all. It is not just the morale booster for the young soldiers on the battlefront against the insurgents, but also a renaissance of confidence on the resolute nature of the Nigerian army. As the Nigerian military remains committed to making sure the country is terror-free, all Nigerians should remain vigilant. The price of liberty is constant vigilance. I advise that you report any suspicious movements around you to law enforcement agents. It is high time we stop politicizing the war on terrorism. What affects one affects all. The killings of our brothers and sisters in the Northeast is our concern. And no effort is too much at tackling the surge of terrorism. Over 20,000 Nigerians have been killed by these mindless terrorists. And only a united force, energized by love and self-interest, can defeat this evil called terrorism. There is no need for comparison between the present and past administrations in the fight against terrorism. When we win, Nigeria wins. And when we lose, Nigeria loses. And since we have chosen to win, let's put aside all forms of thoughts of primitive, ethnic, and religious sentiments. It is high time we stop blaming one another for our misfortunes, and let's start celebrating our strengths. Let's support our armed forces. I am Ben Murray Bruce, and I just want to make common sense.